I just got a surgery. Okay. To be a virgin again. So you're industry. a virgin porn star. Yes. Wow. I want to to find a good guy who he will take my virginity. Wow. <laughs> the dude's mind's blown now. <laughs> What's up guys, John Anthony here from John Anthony Lifestyle. In today's video, we're gonna be reacting to I am Heli, or I am Healy, getting vagina surgery to become a virgin again. Great, looks like Undead Chronic had his dream come true. Okay, that's the dumb black pill guy that says, unless a girl is a virgin, she is worthless. Okay, now everyone can become a virgin again. I come here to tell you something new. Yeah, you, you said you had a big surprise for us. Yes, Okay. <laughs> I'm excited. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I got, I just got a surgery Okay. to be a virgin again. What does that mean? How is that possible? You got I, a new puss? No, no, no. I it, love this dude already. You got a new puss? A new puss? A new skin? Yeah, but what, what's the logistics of the surgery? Like, <laughs> This guy, he's just fucking knocking back beers with a fucking money jacket. <laughs> it's like throwing shit out there. How are you? I, I don't understand. But the, the <laughs> surgery. So I've heard of getting their titties done, BBLs. No, no. Never heard of a brand new pussy. He put a skin. <laughs> okay. On the, the hymen? The hymen. Yeah. You got a, a new, new hymen. Oh. New hymen. Okay, the hymen. Okay. <laughs> Pop my cherry. It yes, all makes sense now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't get it. So you got a new hymen installed in your pussy, yes. and now you're a virgin again. Yes. <laughs> and it's been seven days. Of, of the new... The, the new, virginity. And you're not fucking anyone? No. What's the plan? Like you're saving it for marriage now? Yeah, but I want to... <laughs> Look at over here on the right. This fucking whole team of doctors. She's saving herself for marriage. Okay, 2024. The single-celled organisms that we began as would be quite proud. I want to restart my body count to zero. So... <laughs> <laughs> she said new bodies. <laughs> I don't. I'm trying to fucking hit 2K in the next year and a half. This is legit. Yeah, but it's it's new. Has anyone done this before? I don't think so. I've never heard of this. Ever. I've never heard of this either. Yeah. Okay. Did but I, I, I do a research and I think I'm the first one in the I think so. So you're industry. a virgin porn star? Yes. Wow. But. <laughs> the dude's mind's blown now. He's like, so you do porn, but you've never had sex. She's like, yes, exactly. It's that simple. Now she's a virgin again. I will be in Miami February 28th through March 3rd. It's the only time you can train with me live, okay, in 2024. It is a five-day immersive experience. Spots are almost out. You can apply with the link in the description or to just train with me virtually or do a live boot camp anywhere around the world. Go book a free strategy call with the link in the description. I'm not porn star. I do only fans. Right. Yeah. Right. Okay, so... <laughs> this dude's pretty funny. He's like, so you got a new puss? Look at his jacket. There's like fucking shit on the side there. He's got a hashtag. He's got a, a dollar sign. He's just knocking back beers. And he's like, okay. Who's going to be the lucky dude? I don't know. <laughs> I want to, to find a good guy to uh, who he will take my virginity. Wow. That's the most wholesome thing I've ever heard. That's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> the dude's like, I've got a dick. That's amazing. No, but I just want to restart fresh. Yeah. I, yeah. I think it counts. I don't restart fresh like Fresh Prince CEO. Oh, uh, I think and so. I record, I film uh, the whole uh, surgery. Okay, good. Because oh. to be honest, I don't know if I believe you. Yes, I have <laughs> the receipt. I ha <laughs> she has the receipt for the vagina surgery. I have the whole <laughs> video, and you can uh, see my pussy, <laughs> and I have picture video. Making her dad proud. She shouldn't be wearing shirts like that either. If she's you know, not in good enough shape there. So Joran say, oh my God, this is it. You are now virgin. And <laughs> and the video, it come everyone like. <laughs> it's like you're having a baby. Yeah, yeah. And he say, welcome to the world. <laughs> <laughs> yes. To your brand new vagina. Yes. Wow. So she went from being a chicken mom, a new body count. <laughs> now it's completely. No, my, my body count is. <laughs> See, guys, for anybody that's watching that's a virgin, you're trying to get the count started. She's trying to reset it. Okay, different world. Zero now. So What I'm about fresh. the last seven days? I that's like the best way to defeat any slut shaming ever. She's like, you guys think I'm a slut because I do porn and fuck a lot of guys? Boom. 
new hymen, body count zero. Or you could just, <laughs> I was going to say, or you could just be Myron Gaines, but he's getting some, some showbiz puss. Good for him. You taking any anal? No, not, not yet. <laughs> so complete new version. <laughs> okay, I, I'm, I'm okay with you doing anal until you find a guy to take a virginity. Yes, I don't think too. it counts. I, I will, no, it, it doesn't count. We had some girls in high school that did that. They said, oh, my dad's a <laughs> Catholic priest just fucked me in the <laughs> ass. You had yeah. girls do that? I think that was common practice. Yes. Very Catholic. Very Catholic. <laughs> yeah. I did that. In the <laughs> She's like, yep, I used to get fucked in the butt instead of losing my virginity. And now I've ran my body count up and I've reset it to zero. God bless her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you lost your anal virginity before your virginity? Imagine you're on a date. They're like, so what do you do? She's like, oh, I get fucked every day by different random guys and porn. They're like, wow, how many guys have you slept with these days? She's like, zero. <laughs> She's like, look, I have the receipt of my hymen being reconstructed. <laughs> This dude's fucking loving life. This is like, must be surreal sitting on the couch there. <laughs> so It counts. No, yeah. It definitely no, counts. No, it don't. It, it doesn't count. It, it doesn't count. Not count. Counting. Right, it doesn't. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. So my <laughs> pussy is fresh at zero and my ass, it's uh, another sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so is Myron's. But you wouldn't understand unless you played sports. <laughs> Cece, did you start booty or, or the normal way? Normal. I've actually never done booty yet. Oh, oh yeah. wow. So I'm the other way around. <laughs> the guy's like, okay. okay. So yeah. you're the, the opposite. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I squirt more in the, uh, in the ass. You really? squirt more? Yeah. From That's the Hershey squirts. The vagina though. Yes. If yes. you're getting fucked in the ass? <laughs> yeah, because it, 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 it take my G spot. Right. So but do you play with the uh <laughs> the dude's like dead serious. He's like, right, right, but uh do you touch the clit or what's going on? No, you not just don't even... and it just squirts? Yeah, it squirts just from like anal. crazy. In just and you don't touch anal. the vagina. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. Every time I No wonder Fresh Prince CEO is always covered in sweat. Do -do -do -do. That's enough of that. <laughs> this is like waiting. I was like, I gotta go make a, a video. I gotta go work upstairs. Get on the application for Miami, if you want to train with me at the end of February and early March, February 28th through March 3rd, or if you'd like to just train virtually over the course of eight weeks, we can systematically fix all your weaknesses in the game and permanently solve all your dating problems for good. Okay, that's my promise to you. So get on one of those calls. Let me know what you think about all this stuff in the comments here about girls becoming a virgin again. Let me know also if you're an actual virgin and how this makes you feel that she's being an imposter and masquerading as a as a as one of you <laughs> like the video if you found value and subscribe to never miss daily videos thank you guys and i'll see you on a video soon take care jumped back in the dating world it was confusing it nothing was working probably one of the areas of my life where i couldn't really figure out on my own you just get rejected rejected you get on the apps you swipe all the time and you you're just happy to get a match like once or twice a month lots of sporadic inconsistent results getting uh ghosted um closing uh night game i don't know what i'm doing with that <laughs> honestly the thing i struggle with most is um it's a weird way to say it but like simping so like when women give me shit tests i'm very much like oh let me just cater to whatever they want and got into rsd stuff i thought it was a big waste of time and wrote it off uh, fortunately, last year I found John's stuff. It was actually practical. It spoke to me. Within just a few couple days, Eddie ended up with five dates scheduled, and one of the girls was the hottest girl he'd ever gotten a number from, but she has like almost 200,000 followers on Instagram. This program has walked me through it. It has helped strengthen all the weak chains in the link to where I can just pull. I have like three dates set for tonight, so I'm just mass stacking dates for the same time frame in case one cancels hot girls, girls who have like master's degrees and like are ballet, you know, ballerinas professionally and beautiful stunners, they light up when I talk to them just being myself. That was like the biggest thing because like, yeah, it's amazing. Real talk. I was really sincere, but um, John's the real deal. You guys, and you guys are all genuinely uh, care about each other's success. That's, 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 that, was the big, that was the biggest sticking point for me was trust, because if I haven't had trust, trust yeah, well, Just kind of changing my mindset and saying, okay, this stuff can work for me, it's possible. You know, John's a real guy, he's not just some 
guy from the internet. Since they have all the steps lined out for them in advance, a lot of guys are talking like they have the cheat codes now. There's no more guesswork, there's no more curveballs. They know exactly what to say, they know exactly what to do. When something comes up, they already have a game plan for how to deal with it. And the results have been nothing short of spectacular. Like, I can just spread my wings and fly. Um, I put in a lot of work, I got a lot more numbers than I've ever gotten before. Today, I kid you not, he sent out to the group, he has a date set up with a girl that's like a 9.5 that's coming straight to the house to split a bottle of wine. The hot, super hot blonde chick is like an Instagram model with 179,000 followers, very casual. And she lights up and they're like, oh hey, and then we walk in the store and now I have a date with her when I go back to New York City. It's crazy. I saw him walking around in the club last night, leading like a hot blonde with like a tight skirt, just walking through the club, leading her by the hand, sitting down with her, vibing with her, getting her on board to come home. in the group, hey, you know, there's this girl with like a shelf ass that's like ready to leave soon, blah, blah, blah. So when I really was reflecting on the way here, like, what is the number one thing I would take away is that basically that the social world, whether it's men, women or whatever, is not a scary, negative place. Like that whole frame this whole week completely shifted. So now when I go into a venue, it's not like potential rejections, but it's potential smiles, opportunity, friends, um, new uh, girls that I can see. Like, so there's just so much like positive. Yeah. Like yeah. It's so small, like, why, why, does, why did that even occupy my mind for so long? And Jay don't stand in line, I ain't never had to wait. I'm the realest in this game, I ain't never had to fake. Just take a look at the scores, I put numbers up on the boards. I'm in a section with models, and you're at the bar trying to get out of cluster of fours. Fixed drama factor, I'm a boss tycoon. My dick smell like two chicks before noon.